Hey gang, Scott here. For you Lightroom Classic users out there, Adobe dropped a new update maybe five or six days ago as this video goes live. They put in a bunch of new features, uh, some uh, some nice add-ons, and that's what this video is about. One of the the nice, uh, yeah, we've seen this in other products feature, you know, removing dust spots automatically. This video, I'm gonna quickly just show you how it works. And, and overall, it's pretty good. I will use it, but I won't necessarily always rely on it. Let's have a look. So for a photo like this, we can see I've got a couple of dust spots that are obviously visible in the upper left. And where has Adobe put the uh, dust spot removal? It's in our erasing tools, remove tools. We have something called distraction removal. And there's a few things, reflection and people, we saw that in, in previous incarnations. And now we have dust, so we can simply just choose apply. And Adobe thinks for a moment, you notice those spots disappeared, but if you're curious what's going on here, we can still visualize the spots. I'll turn off apply. You can see it found you know, a bunch, you know, some couple of other here that weren't immediately visible. We put apply back on. And if you needed to change anything, you move your cursor into the area here and you can pick one of the spots and, and do whatever you might need to do with it. Refresh it, delete it. You know, you can, uh, just, if you if you finds a thing that you think isn't a spot, you can correct it. But you'll also notice that it left a couple behind. Like there's there's one here in the upper left, there's another one here in the upper right. So we still have our, our classic removal tool. And so I'll start with that dust removal because it does a pretty good job and I haven't seen it uh, you know, being overly aggressive. And so then I'm all done with that and now I have my, my sky cleaned. So yeah, that's uh, that's basically it. It is really that straightforward. Apply it, it'll find uh, what it thinks are spots. You have the opportunity to remove any of those ones that you, if it gets uh, you know overly uh, aggressive in finding something that isn't a spot. And of course, we still have the remaining tools, which I still think I'm gonna reach for because the dust spot you know, automatic detection, great jump start. Don't rely on it for perfect, pristine object or distraction removal. So uh, there you have it. Any other questions, drop them below. And until next time, my name's Scott Davenport. Have fun.